What's going on? My name is David and this garage door opener is awesome. It's by Chamberlain. It's got a video camera built into it. You can control it from your phone and you can even have your Amazon packages delivered into your garage if you want. It's crazy quiet and I really love all of the features that they put into this thing. It's a great product. I'm going to go through how we installed this thing on this garage. We replaced an existing screw-driven door opener that was really loud and getting very old. So we got a whole new system here, but you could just replace this operator with a new one. It also has a battery backup. So what happens when the power goes out and you can't open your garage? Not this one. You've got a built-in battery backup that's right stored inside of here. And the light on this thing alone is basically illuminating the entire garage. It's a great product. And uh, right now I'm going to get into the installation. It's a, it's a quite a lengthy video. If you're not planning to install it yourself, you don't have to go through the whole thing, but it's, um, it's a well-constructed product and I absolutely have been enjoying it. Okay. We just uh, took it out of the box here and looks like it even comes with the, uh, comes with the rail and everything. So we're gonna get this uh, put together and get it up there and we'll show you how quiet this thing operates. Okay, so the rail pieces, they just all sort of snap together, just like that. And you got a big long rail. Okay, now we're going to attach the rail to the garage door opener. Let's see how long this guy is here. The rest of the hardware, you got the pool wire and the belt. We'll slide in the carry onto the rail now. And now we're going to insert one side of the belt that hooks onto the carry. Buy the pulley in with the pin and we've got a washer and a nut that goes on underneath here. Just hand tight for now. Snug it up. All right, we're going to stretch this belt tight. Bring it all the way around here over this other gear and wrap it all the way back around. I'm gonna attach a linkage here and a spring, almost like a bicycle chain clip. And then you have your spring. And that is gonna to attach to the other end of the carrier here. So your belt has to be more or less tight, but not crazy tight. So now we got to loosen this locking spring here. There we go. Now the spring is activated. Don't forget that. Attaching the emergency rope here. Just put a little knot in it and another knot around the other side. Now you got your pull cord ready. We've got a cover for the gear here. I'm going to go on with a couple screws. Okay, the kit also came with the safety eyes. We're gonna go ahead and get those installed and run the wires around as necessary. We've got a little mounting clip for these guys with a specific screw and a wing nut and put a little, a little coil in the cable for some extra slack. Clip the other one on, just like so. I'm going to take the wire and staple it on the way up. Keep it nice and tight using some very small fine staples. I'm going to run these wires <clears throat> all the way up and over to the middle. Coming all the way across. Okay, we're going to put the bracket right in the center here to hold the, the opener. Stop.
stopper or the limiter so that the garage door doesn't continue to open past where it needs to. It's a little nut on the end of that. Okay, we're lifting up the opener and putting it into the framing. All right, now we're gonna connect the door to the operator. A couple screws here, little cotter pin type things. And this piece here needs to be at an angle. Uh, two bolts there. Okay, we've got the backup battery. This is going to allow the door operator to open and close in the event of a power outage. You just got two wires to clip on there for positive and negative. And then it slides inside of the garage door housing, just like that. We need to wire the safeties uh, in series. So we're going to take each of those wires, strip them a little bit, and get them together on the connections. Okay, we've got colored connections, black with black. simple for the safety circuit okay we got the back of the keypad here and we're gonna go ahead and wire up you've got white and red super easy let's get those tucked around there nice and gentle Go ahead and download the app by using the QR code here on the door. Perfect. The connections from the operator or from the, from the control on the wall. We need to program the limits. So we're gonna push a button up there. Okay. Super, super quiet. Now the limit is adjusting and going back down. Okay, now it's getting ready to test and make sure that the limits are set correctly. So it's gonna go up and down again. Okay, it's starting to slow down. Looks like that's correct. And we're on our way back down. There we go. And now it's done. We've got the uh, keypads here and they come pre-programmed. So it works, we can stop it and close it. That's nice, you don't have to deal with anything with that. Okay, so now we're gonna program on the app a garage door opener. Uh, opener with camera is the one that we got. And we're gonna check all of these, Bluetooth, everything. Okay, I'm gonna click I'm ready. And let's go take a look at which wall. Okay, so I think this is the one that I have here. Now I have to press learn two times. All right, I heard a beep, so I'm gonna click yes and allow it. There is my device and it's connecting. So yeah, we wanna pair it. Okay, we did have to push a button up here inside of there, but now it is beeping and I think it's connecting. Okay, we got several more beeps out of it. Now we can name it. We'll just name it garage door because I don't have any other ones, but I guess if you had multiple ones, you could name them differently. 
Wow, finished. Let's set up um, delivery on this thing. So I'm gonna get packages delivered into the garage from Amazon, really cool. Just to recap, we've got the garage door installed. We've got the new operator here. This thing has a camera on it and uh, we can get packages delivered. It's got an app that we can control and invite users to. It's really cool. I'll show you here. We can even live stream. Let's see if I can get this going. There I am on the camera. You see me, I'm waving there. So you can open and close the garage door from here. Uh, you take a look, you've got your safety release, pretty standard, so in case you need to shut it by itself. You can also adjust the angle of the camera, depending on what you want. I like it there. Um, a really great installation, keypad over here on the wall. So you can close the door, you can turn the light, quiet there's the light switch on this thing I'm gonna undo undo this bulb because the light is actually really quite bright you can see it's just like illuminating the entire garage here uh, couldn't be happier with this installation if you're looking for a great garage door opener that's quiet with smart connectivity you can get your packages delivered from Amazon this Chamberlain one is the way to go